Oh, man. Um, thank you so much. Thank you to the American Theatre Wing. Uh, okay, I want to thank some people. I want to thank Greg Noble, Patrick Cotullo, <laughs> Dee Dee Gardner, everyone at Sea View and 101 and Plan B. Uh, I want to thank uh, Paul Libin for letting us use your beautiful theatre. It was such an honor doing this play at Circle in the Square. Um, my, my brilliant cast, uh, the design team and the whole production team that, that worked on this play. Um, yeah, I, I wanna thank the, the ushers and the front of house staff who, um, who, who see me walking in every day looking like I've just been run over by a truck and, and see me walk out looking somehow even worse uh, with like bits of pretzels and aquavit in, in my hair. Um, Linda, thank you for sewing 50,000 buttons uh, back onto my shirts every night. Uh, Molly Kearns, I couldn't have done this without you. I think a lot of people in this room share that sentiment. Um, Sam and Amy, uh, you guys, thank you. <laughs> this is crazy. Sam, thank you for being everything an actor could hope for in a director and uh, for bringing new meaning to the term ice bucket challenge. Um, <laughs> Amy, for your masterful work on this play. Uh, the last time I did a play of yours, I met Emma, my wife, who, who I now have three beautiful children with, um, and now uh, this play. Um, Real quick, uh, this play is a cry from the heart and an exhortation to face up to the difficult truths that are staring us all down right now. Uh, it's been a privilege to give its warning and its hope to audiences. This is for my mom and my dad who are here tonight somewhere. Mom, dad, thank you for allowing me to imagine. <laughs> 